Alrighty guys, I'm excited. I have a special knife here for you. This one is the Case 2023 Vault Pattern. And this specific one is the Amberbone Peach Seed Jigged Small Congress, model number 6468 Stainless Steel Blades. And as this blade mentions, this is a Pilot Tessera knife. It's one of the first Congresses produced for other people. This knife is pretty small, and I'll do some comparisons later, but real quick, I want to take a look at the blades. So you have a sheep's foot, a smaller pen blade, a coping blade, and then kind of a drop point or spear point blade right here. We'll give you a quick overall look at the knife, try to give you up close views of that amber jigged Peach seed bone, very nice. Case shield. Kind of those long to medium nail pulls. You got two back springs. With those brass liners. And I'll talk about those more later. Here's the reverse side. Brass pins. Tested XX on that pen blade and then here is the tang marking USA 6468 stainless steel on that kind of drop point blade this knife is pretty light it weighs 1.42 ounces I weighed it myself these larger blades are about 1.8 inches in length and then these smaller ones are about 1.4 the length closed is three inches. So again, a small knife. You get close up on that coping blade, SS stainless steel. Very nice. No half stops on this knife. Pretty smooth action. I did have this I did uh, clean this knife because it came a little dirty in the joints from the factory. That usual black grease gunk stuff. But like I said before, I'm not sure if you can see it, but the outer liners are doubled up. So they have two, two liners on the right and left. Let's see if you can see that. And then one kind of larger liner in the middle. And I'm guessing they did that to give it more space for the four blades without them having to rub. And there's small rubbage on these outer blades kind of touch the, the brass liner a little bit, which, I mean, we all like them to be perfect, but I get that they can't. It's a four-bladed knife, and they're, it's a pretty small knife, so it's harder to do that the smaller the knife and the more blades it has. But pretty good walk and talk, pretty light pulls on all these blades. Not the best of snap. Some better than others. The grind, not the best either. But nothing that a sharpening stone or whatever sharpening system you prefer won't fix. Um, I know a lot of people like these knives to be perfect right out of the box. And maybe they could have been better at the price point. They think these go for around $68. Well, this model. In particular so almost $70 for a really small knife but you get four blades a lot of hand work that goes into these nice stainless steel this is their true sharp stainless steel the case is famous for pretty good fit and finish on the back springs and the bone smooth transitions overall not bad Real quick before I forget, let me show you the box. It's kind of like an ordinary case box. Nothing that special. Um, this one was made in July of 2022, so quite a while ago. Over six months ago. Cool. And then it comes with the ordinary case papers. But I wanted to give you a quick look on this new 2023 pattern. I'll do a more in-depth kind of use of this knife. I will do a whittling video soon, 
So I feel like this, be a, this is a perfect whittling knife, especially for your pocket, for your small, bunch of small blades, perfect for whittling smaller pieces of wood. And I've said before, I want to get more into whittling. But before, let's do a quick size comparison. So this was, this is a small swell center jack, the 2022 case fault pattern. And they're the same size and length, but the jack is a little fatter. I think you'll be surprised when you get this knife in hand how small it is. That one, and then just for the fun of it, here's a ordinary case trapper, and then a Rough Rider Barlow for the Rough Rider lovers out there. So I think that's going to be it. Not a very in-depth review, but I just wanted to get this video out there for those people that are anxious to see these. Um, you can get these, I think, online on eBay. They have some of these pilot test run knives on eBay. They're like a couple dollars more than um, the original production or just the production knives. But you, you can get them sooner if that's what you want, if you can't wait. Alrighty, I think that is it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe.